Hey there, Jed Coverness here from jedcoverness.com and welcome to Talk Therapy. It's just a tool that I use to get into the moment, to clear my mind, to just hang out for a little bit and not worry about what others would think, what myself would think, and just be real, be truthful, be deep, get away from the shallowness of being you know, just, I don't even know, just hanging out. So here we go. What can today bring? Who knows? What will I say? Nobody ever knows. I don't even know what I'm going to say. And that's the best part. Weather is what it is. It's about to get really cold this weekend. I'm talking like real temps again, right? Of we've been here before of like minus 30 or something like that like below 30 below real temp not even counting wind chill like oh well weather's weather that is the surface level of conversation hey what's up guy how's the weather you're like no like okay but really it's just the surface level of where everybody begins to get into the moment get past the surface and you can go deep and feel really 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 cool really fun really raw and that is where a lot of people fear right you can't talk about that you can't go that deep you can't you shouldn't right you it's it's not polite to go that deep and crazy and whatever like deep equals crazy apparently but that's that's the fun part. That's where the real truth resides. That's where the raw feelings are. That's where if you can really get past all the bullshit, that is where it's fun. Because as a human, we really, really, really fear the depth. We want to stay surface because that feels comfortable. That feels okay. We don't have to deal with anything. We don't have to face all of our fears head on. And that's all right. If that's where you're feeling that you need to stay, do that. But if it doesn't, if you are not happy, let it all go. Let it go. Just let it be, right? Like, so many songs tell us to do that. If you really listen to music... Like, really get past what music is and get into, like, what a a song is saying. They're only talking to themselves, right? All songs are only talking to themselves. The The ones that really resonate with you, the ones that really slow down the static, the noise for you, like you really groove and get into it, are the ones that you are aligned, they speak to your soul, they speak to your alignment of destiny, if you will, I know I'm going deep right away, and that's really fun, and this is awesome, and I mean really, that's what it takes, that's what the fun part is, is realizing that the song is speaking to themselves, right? Like the singer, the writer, whoever created it is only talking to themselves. Like getting to somewhere, doing some whatever it is. It's really breaking it all down to here's what's up. Here is how to become the depth that you are. And stop fearing. Actually, not stop fearing. Because you need fear. You need fear. Because without fear, you can't have courage. You can't. Right? Like, it's a duality thing. Like, without fear... Like, if you would be like, oh, I'm fearless. I never have fear. Well, okay, so then you never have courage either. Like... Acknowledge fear, accept fear, be like, yeah, cool, I'm afraid of this, and be aware of that, self-awareness of fear, I'm so afraid of this, cool, be afraid of it, accept the fear, 
Acknowledge the fear. Look at it. Give it some attention. Not a ton, but some. Give it the attention that requires enough to get to the other side of it so that courage can come to the surface from below, right? Because that's where everything comes from, deep down inside of you, and then it comes to the surface, and then that's where it happens. The only way to get to courage is to look at fear, and you could say face your fears, but that one has been completely manipulated face your fears no you know like oh i'm so afraid of this i'm gonna face my fears well we've been there new explanations are required now for facing your fear it's getting into fear and looking at it and going hi let's get acquainted versus avoiding it because avoiding it you can go a lifetime avoiding your fears and then you have learned and or experienced nothing new nothing so then when you get into the courage because that's what comes after fear get past fear and into courage and that's the fun part because then you have the courage to fear whatever that is no more so have fun with that Really play with that. Oh no, I'm afraid of what? I am afraid of letting go. Personally, me sitting here talking to me. I am afraid of letting go of my gym. Letting go of personal training. Letting go of coaching people. Letting go of what I've worked on for which seems like a very long time but it's not uh you know since 2000 what it'd be 15 14 ish i don't know um five six years letting go of that right letting go of it i'm afraid of that i'm afraid of letting go but today i feel that i'm not afraid to let it go anymore i'm not afraid to just leave it Yeah, I'm not afraid to just leave it and leave it be and let it be and whatever is going to happen is going to happen. And if nothing ever happens, I'm good with it. If everything ever happens, I'm good with it. Like I'm truly at a place of acceptance. I accept where I'm at with it. I can keep creating. I know this. I've done it. I've done it. I've done it many, many, many times over again. And I accept and that sigh right there leads me to believe that I truly am. Because I feel like that was my ego going, okay, I agree. Because it has no choice. Like I'm aligning and resonating with my soul, my destiny, my deep down, the whatever you want to understand, God, source, whatever then you start to not have the resistance and stuff just starts to happen synchronicities start to happen crazy things start to happen but they're not crazy they're actually very normal because you're not fighting the fear any longer you at that point the faith gets deeper and stronger and and the endurance is like just going forever and ever and ever like there is no end and that is because the fear then dissolves and courage comes to the surface and there is no risk anymore because it doesn't feel like risk the risk is gone. We're like, oh, take risks. What, what if this and that? Well, there is none of that when it all just comes together. 
with whatever you're doing. It doesn't have to be what you think. It doesn't have to be the plan. Because the plan is the now, is right now. There is no other plan. There is just plan. Right? Not the plan, but plan. Like, plan. Breathe. There you go. Plan. Achieved. Move on to the next thing. And the next thing. And the next thing. That's the fun part. I feel like that's the shift. It's a big shift. Just letting go. So many people, just we just sit there as humans and just look at it and... We just got to look at it, right? Just sit there and look at it. It's really what it is. Just look at it. Sit there, look at it, and let it go. Acknowledge it. Yes, fear of letting go. I have fear of letting go. Because I put so much time and so much effort and so much... But, but Okay, cool. Good job. I'm loving it. I feel like if I let it go and just let it, like, I don't do anything with it anymore, it will just go away. Oh, well. Let it go away. Maybe it was supposed to go away. Maybe that is done, right? And I've always wanted to own my own business. I'm afraid of not owning my own business in my life, in this life. Maybe I'm not destined to own my own business in this lifetime maybe my next one I don't know but fearing it being afraid of not owning my own business isn't going to get me there right yeah right right I'll answer my own self right because that's who I'm talking to fearing not having is not going to have any faster accepting the fear accepting accept I accept all my fears so that courage can surface so that my fear will dissolve and I will actually look at it and it won't actually be anything at all it'll be the big scary monster that I painted And then I realized I'm afraid of monsters after I hung it up on the wall. And then what I do, what I get to do, is look at that picture. Look at that painting that I painted. And realize I'm afraid of it. And just look at it for a second. And then I get to take it down, right? I get to take that picture down. And then it no longer is there. And then I'm no longer afraid. Because I stopped, I looked at it. I seriously just looked at it and went, yep, I'm done with it. And then took it down. And then I have no more fear of that picture. No more fear lingering around, hanging around. (laughs) That picture on the wall literally hanging around. So there it is. Do that. And do more of that. Have fun today. I'm telling myself that and anybody listening. Have fun today. Thank you for listening. Hit share, like, comment, subscribe. Whatever the button is, please hit it. I really appreciate it if you do. And if you don't, I'm good with that too. I'm good with it. Because I just let it go. Like, if you do it, great. If you don't, oh well. Not oh well isn't a bad thing. Just oh well because I don't expect anything. And I expect it all the same time (laughs) as always if you're willing to change from the neck up then you will change from the neck down i believe in you now it's your turn to start believing in yourself stay safe out there be blessed bye for now